Hvad er det sådan? Svær. Oh ja, yeah, that's that's the Giga Ragnar. Short burst smoke. Nine camp radar. Giga speed boost heal. Surely he won't blow up instantly. Oh, I'm spotted. He wants to accelerate again once he sees the shells coming, but that thing doesn't accelerate very well, so it's too late. Concentrate fire on the enemy warship. Enemy cruiser sighted. Enemy severely damaged. Strong joke. All stations, concentrate fire on the target. This guy running hydro? No, he doesn't have a hydro, does he? What? What's the torp? She might have torps. The ship is on fire. Yeah, we should probably play around the idea that there might be drops coming. This guy isn't paying attention. Actual benefit of the reload mode there, that I got my guns ready for that turn. Off to a great start. We destroyed an enemy cruiser. That was like one of those shots. Those rare cases where the leg mod um Leg mode came in useful, where I got to shoot. When you get to shoot instant on cooldown, that's when it's strong. Problem solved, sir. Confirmed penetration. Assume she must start now. Bit risk is tr changing to reverse here. But I have so many juicy targets here. It would make sense if torps here instead, because there's more targets and not doesn't go for the individual. Shoot for the superstructure. Chunk him out. We want to hit our shells here. Juicy superstructure. Get full pens on it. Enemy destroyer sighted. Yeah, pretty junk. All stations, reporting the position of a strategic target. RP Amato, classic positioning, being as useless as possible. Mm. Playing <laughs> what is broken. No fucking is that bad. Spotter returning to ship. The ship is on fire. Mm, I think the Shima is dead. Do they need me on that? Oh, I went down. Really. Enemy ship detected. He's stopping. This guy likes stopping and acceleration juking, so we shoot as if he's gonna stop. I think he's being too predictable with his jukes, so I think I might nail him with that. He realized now he needs to accelerate. Yeah, 16k still. Block. Game bro too. What the fuck are you doing bro? Oh no, his guns can't punch me from there. He's so far away, he's actually managed to neuter his Yamato. That's impressive. Let's go straight in. There we go. Mm. Oh, she must have. They're still shooting at me instead of shooting the Svea, so that's pretty good. Yeah, they're all shooting me, ignoring the, ignoring the guy dumpstering their crews, their destroyer. <laughs> nice. I gotta love being a potato man, but no. I don't love being a potato man. Oh, Soyuz is turning out. Shit. Can we catch that? I'm gonna pretend like I'm not shooting him, so he doesn't turn. Yeah, we're gonna die. We turn our guns now. We don't, we don't lock on to him, then. We just turn our guns. Okay. Ah, uh, he's turning in. Unfortunate. We're winning the other side, so... I'm not really in that much of a hurry to do that much here. I'll just farm as they come in. If the Shima dies, I could run in. 
As long as the Shima is alive, running in means getting dead struck by Torps, so it's a bit cringe. That should be 25k, he's turning flat. I think that's a kill, dead person. In the camp. Okay. Mm. So he's just too close now. Is he really gonna turn in there and kill himself? Oh, he's tunnel visioning on me. That's stupid. Do you think he can get the kill? I think he does. I'm just bathing though. I'm not in any risk of dying here, I'm just a baby. There's Richelieu, he can't punch me from there, those guns are trash. You can overmatch Pen, man. That's a bit cringe, but he's really useless. God, I'm really am a potato, my god, aren't I? Holy oh, shit, okay, 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 okay. Everyone wants to shoot me. Big fans everywhere, holy. Superstructure shoot this guy. And then turn our ship around. Too much focus for it from here. Oh, you're alive. Still shooting me, this fucking Richelieu. Holy shit, bro. When you have 2.3 million potential in, in 8 minutes, you know you're playing on EU. I think I can game return before Richelieu shells land, because he's so fucking far away. He literally can't shoot me in time. Enemy battleship destroyed. Let's go middle now so we can shoot all these guys. Oh, now Yamato decides to push. I think he's gonna turn out. Oh, wait, he's slowing down. Our victory is in sight. You a gamers. Surely they I guess isn't gonna do the same fucking juke again. Oh there's is that a shimmer in the bee? Generally don't know. What's in there? Could be Tulsa, actually. Could be Shima, could be Tulsa. A is on. That's a fair bit of AA. That's Tulsa, that's Tulsa. Okay. The ship is on fire! I'll turn before he gets the shuttle. Full stop to make the turning circle tighter. Okay. Let's bait the Tulsa here a bit. Spotter returning to ship. Still spot though. I'm on fire, so it's like that. I think Tulsa wants to, really wants me. We're gonna bait him a bit here. He sees my low health and he's like, I can get that kill, man. Yeah, yeah, I can. Fucking lock on. Letting him live for an hour. Always a fun. Okay. 
Problem solved, he wants sir. to turn to use all his guns. Baited him with them. We don't let him use his guns. Richard is shooting us, but he's removed himself from the battle again. So his guns are irrelevant. Um, what? They're okay, giving broadside to everyone else while angling against me. There's the ship. We Can the sphere finally kill him? If not, I'll shoot him. Where'd he go? He was turning this way. See if we can jump with some blind fire. Oh, no need. Cool. I get every achievement as always, except for Confederate, which I would like for my reload. I never get fucking Confederate. Don't worry, I'll get Confederate when I shoot the last guy on the enemy team. Bro, please stop giving broadside to Izumo and Poison while angling against me. Can you please do that? Nope, oh, there it is. Now we're late. That's our reload now. 24, that's pretty spicy. Not gonna get to use it much though, I think. Mm. Can we smash? Well, I'll smash and smash. Can we orange farm there again? I think it's reversing as always. He's been doing that all game, so it makes him somewhat predictable. No, accelerated. Shit. This Yamato has certainly been- I should shoot the Yamato. He's an RP Yamato, you know, he's gonna be demented. Honestly, it felt like so much effort for very little um, damage. What's the average damage from the last four month games? I can look. I don't think it's gonna be that good. It's nice turning in. What is it doing? I have to say, uh, this reload is pretty funny. Halsey plus uh, leg mode. Battle ends in five minutes. Well, that's missing his reload mode. They're continually chunking him, it's pretty funny. Oh, cracking. Yeah, no, it felt like so much effort to get the damage now. It felt like so much effort to get the damage. I don't know. Uh, like, see, the difference is, I feel if I wasn't running leg mod brick, I could get much closer to the enemy before I smash them, because I have the concealment and the brisk and the maneuverability. So, the leg mod is absolutely a trade-off. I don't think it's that good. I think it's okay. It, it's like, it's a side grade, but it's very hit and miss. Like, this was a game example of where you got a lot of value out of it. Like, I got a lot of value out of the brick mod this game. Or brick mod, leg mod. Um, shit basics, because uh, we did, we basically farmed a lot of BBs and stuff. Except for the booster that we blew up. Like, 300 shells fired. That's a lot more than you normally fire. Brick mod is fine. Yeah. 
Yeah, no, it's damage received 175 gam. Yeah, no, it's when you get to constantly shoot your guns all the time, unload your guns. It's pretty nice. But I, in most games, I feel it's not nearly as valuable. Like, I've tried it 10 games now, playing solo, and it depends. It depends. I don't know, it depends. I don't really know what my average would be. This one was, yeah, maybe 180-ish. 275, 153, 196, 161, 165, 208. This is the one where we got nothing happened. No, this was the one that grieved. 218, 219, 100. I don't know, maybe 190. Maybe 190 to 200k average in 10 games. Which is obviously a good average um, in a BB. I, I have no complaints about it. It's just that I feel I could probably have achieved that pretty easily with normal brick as well. Without needing to continually shoot my guns to make, to get value out of this thing. I think in, in ranked and in brawls, it's going to be more valuable because you often end up in these small scale one versus one fights where, where um, the reload is actually really valuable. But in general, random battles where you're often just looking for those big, devastating hits, it's questionable value. So considering you have to pay 20k research points to get it, I wouldn't say it's particularly recommended. Like, if, you, if you're debating between this one and the Colombo one, get the Colombo one. The Colombo one is fantastic. The Colombo one is really, really strong. And I would say this one is a direct upgrade. Uh, whereas the Brick mod... Leg mod. <laughs> brick mod. That's gonna be brick mod, isn't it? Uh, the brick mod is a side grade with questionable value. And considering you're paying for this side grade, not that good. What about full reload? I mean, I'm already. This is already a modified build in the sense that uh, I've given up brisk for more raw damage. A super heavy AP is actually pretty nice. I think you could you could give up grease the gears for this. If you didn't run leg mod, because then you got more time between shots. But with leg mod, you also want the turret reverse, because you're literally constantly looking for targets to shoot to get the 10% value. I mean, my normal normal build is this, 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 and then I run this, and I think... Is it maybe this or this? I can't remember. IRR is also great on, on this thing. Furious is hard to justify. Thank you, Felzy. I could see like a full reload mod with, with Furious and this and leg mod being a thing for maybe brawls and stuff, but generally speaking, this upgrade is so much better than leg mod that it's hard to justify. Mm. Yamato or Colombo unique mod? I mean, Colombo is just a better ship right now. Yamato is really, really power crap. Um, what was the leg mod? It's seven percent dispersion. Honestly, it's kind of funny that the Yamato leg mod is minus seven dispersion with a huge penalty to turret traverse, whereas Colombo upgrade is six dispersion, so only one percent less. But there's no penalty to turret traverse, and you get six percent faster reload. <laughs> huh? That's pretty. Wow, this thing is so much better than the Yamato upgrade. Holy shit, this thing is so much better. That's actually pretty crazy. Because Yamato already has really sluggish turrets. So, uh, this penalty puts it at 69 second turret traverse, which is... I mean, you get it down with the commander, of course. The commander takes it down to 57. It helps. But, it's still a big penalty. Wargaming balancing at its finest. I mean, the Yamato one used to be much better, but then they nerfed it. Because they said they didn't want leg mods to be upgraded, so they nerfed a lot of the old ones. But then they released a bunch of new upgrades that are just straight up upgrades. Like the 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 Guten Lu one is a straight up upgrade. Um, the Elbing one is a straight up upgrade. Like once once you slot this leg mod on a Guten Lu, you're never gonna take it off. It's so goddamn good. Like a lot of the recent ones have been very strong. I would say Brick is a bit of an exception that the leg mod isn't really that strong. I'd say. 
Yeah, Shitro Petro leg mod is insane as well. But this this one, it's it's okay. It's okay. It's, it's like ultimately though, if it's simply okay, and I would say the playstyle change isn't really that big because like you don't play a battleship a whole lot of different because you've got. 36 second reload instead of 40 seconds like it's not suddenly gonna shift your playstyle in some big way it just means you you shoot the pad more often that that's it so it's not really a gameplay change shift in that sense um so pretty hard to justify paying 20k research points to 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 for that because uh with like with concealment you get 12.6 conceal on on vermont which is completely busted and it also means you can run brisk because you're basically undetected whenever you're not firing which gives you a lot more speed thanks to your engine power you don't lose the speed as much either it's yeah no it, it, if you're on the fence it's 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 an okay upgrade it's not bad it's not like oh no you wasted your research bureau points if you got it it's it's okay but uh, by no means is it anywhere near the top tier like most of the game right now